Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to export your Blender 3.4 3D avatar and import into Character Creator 4.2 to make it become a CC project or I avatar with embedded materials from Blender. And start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. First, you can see now this is the Blender 3.4. Now I already have an avatar. A 3D avatar that already have the rigs and skeletons and also it already have the texture and material you can you can see this is the texture and material you have so many then back to the layout how are you going to import into the character creator for to make it become become a 3D avatar as the CC project or make it become the eye avatar. So now from the blender, what I'm going to do is the first step, create a new folder on my desktop as demo. I'm going to name this folder as 01 from blender. From the blender, what you are going to do is just export as FBX file. Click here, file, export fbx then export it on my desktop this is the folder send the zero one from blender then to make sure all of the materials and texture embedded inside inside the fbx you have to make sure the path mode choose copy and then make sure you highlight this by default it is auto and it doesn't highlight. You have to make sure it is copy and also highlight here. Then, as demo, I'm going to name this 3D model as model 01 FBX. I click export FBX. Now you can see it already exported as FBX file in this folder. set here if i double click it is going to open by using the 3d viewer in window 10 and everything look normal now open your character creator 4 make sure you already click the new and then make sure you clear everything then drag in the fbx file choose character and here choose humanoid non-standard click apply and wait for a while now it is importing then the first step, what you are going to do is just go and map the skeletons. To map the skeletons, just double click here and double click the bone. Or use the double click. Then this is the hand. To map the fingers, you have to click here. Make sure you activate here. Then if you double click, and map on the finger, it is going to automatic plot the whole finger. See? You no need to map it one by one. Then, the left hand already successfully plots. Just click here to back. Then here, you plot it, map it properly. Now we have another hand here. This is the right hand. Do the same way, map the hand, then the fingers. Make sure you turn here on activate. This is to auto assign the child fingers. So double click and click it. Right. Next, click back. Then, you can see here you have another skeleton that is the, the neck. Click here. Choose the last one. Start from the last one. If, if you have two bones, two neck bones, then you have to pick from the bottom. Then, the bottom one. Then, next one will be the upper one. Then, next, the hip bone. The spine, 
Then click here. This is the only bone. Double click to plot it at here. Choose the last one. Then back. Now it only left the two legs. The tight knee foot. Alright, done. Once done already, click active, then click the characterization. Now it already become a CC project. And the next step is to fix all the materials. Now from the blender you can see all the material no problem because in blender it used the same map, the diffuse and opacity will use the same map. So now in Corrector Creator 4, you check the material. For example, the next one is the eye iris. The first one, the mouth you can ignore. The next one is eye iris. You can see the base color is the diffuse, the opacity map. The opacity map will be another different map in Corrector Creator 4 and also the icon 8. Actually, you can automatically generate the opacity map by using the diffuse if the transparency already con content contained inside the diffuse map just right click to copy and right click to paste it here sorry right click to copy and right click to paste at the same location it is automatic generating opacity map next one is the eye highlight also right click copy the same place right click paste it automatically generate the opacity you can ignore the face the eye white it depends on your your texture now you can see the eye line all done everything back to normal then the whole 3d models already imported into character creator 4 as the cc project next what you are going to do is just save this as project click pass save the project as save in the same folder copy and paste the destination location then the CC project, I'm going to name name this the same name as the original project name, model 01. Then save. It already become a CC project. And also I can export as an I avatar. The I avatar, you can export it at here also, model 01.i avatar, save. The I avatar you can use it to perform the 3D animation in your iCron. 3D animation software and everything gets simple. Right now, everything already done. You already successfully exported the humanoid 3D models from Blender 3.4 and import into Creator Creator 4.2 to make it become a CC project and also the eye avatar that you can use it in Creator Creator 4 and also the icon 8 with embedded materials and texture. All right, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my video tutorial and sharing, if you feel all these tutorials and sharing are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animation and game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video tutorial or sharing, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animation and game developing. See you!